What's up guys, Lacey the truck driver here. If you're new to my channel, um, I am a over the road slash regional truck driver and my channel is about health, um, nutrition, anything trucking related that's going to make trucking easier and more convenient for you. So this also can be applied to people who want to live kind of more minimalistic or they're always on the go and they need some solutions to help them be better prepared on the go. So I'm actually in my house right now and I've been kind of on this kick of trying to find the perfect bag. So I'm going to Italy in March and I was trying to find a new backpack that I could take on the plane with me that would be kind of just a nicer backpack for travel and I started finding all these new styles of backpacks that they have out now that are kind of like a suitcase and or a duffel bag and so I ordered a few of these bags hoping that I could replace my trucking bag system into just one of these bags so what I do right now is I just have like a like a gym duffel bag so I put all my clothes and stuff in there when I go out on the road and then I also have a one of those just kind of plastic bags that I use for that you can take to the grocery store and use as a grocery bag and I put all my food in it and then I also have my backpack that has my laptop, my GoPro equipment, my filming equipment that I use, my study materials. I also have a half gallon water bottle that has a strap on it so just from leaving my house to getting to my truck I have a duffel bag, a backpack, a half gallon water bottle, and a food bag. So I'm just like my hands are full so I'm trying to minimize things and I think I found the perfect bag but I'm going to show you three options so you guys can decide if you want to try this out too. So I'm going to dive in and show you guys what I have found here. So this one is the Heinz Eagle Weekender bag I think is what it's called and it's pretty cool uh, the so what you can do with this one is you can unzip it here don't know how close I am to the camera here how much you can see but there's just some you know basic backpack storage pockets right there and then there is this pocket here for more storage, laptop sleeve, um, another thicker sleeve to store an iPad or something in it. And this comes undone. So there's that. You can see that there. And then if you're done with that, you can fit all your laptop stuff in there. And then it opens sideways like this into a duffel bag. And so what you can do is you could fit like a couple weeks of clothes in here if you had some packing cubes and then you could just put like your dirty clothes up here or your shoes or cosmetics you know whatever you want underwear up in there and then it has these cinch straps like a regular um, duffel bag would and then you can just cinch it down but obviously like packing cubes would be ideal for this type of situation to stay organized and to really um, push everything together so you can fit more stuff in here but that's really cool so you zip it back up and then the back here is just regular style backpack so the cool thing about these backpacks and uh, the, the first two I'm going to show you both do this but you can just unclip them and you can hide the straps away like this so if you wanted to go briefcase style they have little handles on each side to carry it just like a briefcase so and then this has a little cup holder right here it's I don't know I haven't tried to put a cup holder in here or a mug in here or anything yet I don't know how realistic it is. I think it'd be good for a 20 ounce bottle, but I don't know anything bigger than that if it would uh, really work out. But yeah, so that's the Heinz Eagle. Uh, I think it's called the Weekender. 
but it's a, they come in different sizes too, so you can get, if you want a bigger one, you can get a bigger one. And the material, I read a lot of comments on Amazon, um, I'll link all these on, in my description on Amazon uh, below, and you can click on the link and go check them out if you want, but these, I got a lot of complaints that the material was really uh, kind of like elementary school feeling, but I actually feel like it's a really nice bag, so I don't know if they upgraded the material since those reviews were posted, but it's really good quality in my opinion. So, this bag is the first one that I bought. This is the Witzman duffel bag or something like that. And recreation bag Witzman style casual collection. So this bag, I this was the first one I got because I wasn't a fan of how these other two bags looked online, but now that I have them in person, I actually don't mind them at all. But online, the pictures just didn't really do it justice, I felt like, and I felt like this one was better material and just a little bit better looking. But this one has an interesting system. So it has a cup holder here. It has a pocket right down here for, you know, whatever, small stuff. It's got handles on all sides, not this side, handles on these two sides, so you can grab it like a duffel bag if you want. And then it's got this right here. Hope you guys can see this, okay. It's got this right here, and then, you know, just like a laptop area. But this is really thin, so there's not a lot of protection. And when I filled it up with all my clothes, it was really hard to get this zipper or anything to fit in here. So, and I'll show you why in just a second. But the other thing that I don't like about this bag is to get the zipper undone, you have to get way up under here and force it around. And when the bag is full, it's not that easy to do. So that's my complaint with this one. My other complaint that I had with it, but it could be a benefit for some of you guys, is it's side loading. So it loads like a duffel bag. And I'll show you the inside here. So if you can see in there, it's got a divider. Can you see it? I don't know. It has a divider in there, right here. And it has like pen holders, and you know, a little other couple pockets, and then this is your space. So you kind of have to stuff things in this way. And a lot of people on the reviews use this bag for like a two week backpacking trip around Europe, and they said it was great. They're like, it's the best bag I've ever had, but you need packing cubes. So if you like this style, then this would be a really good bag. It comes in two different sizes. This is the smaller one. This is the 18 inch. But it's all right. Like, I love the looks of it, but it's just not what these two bags are. So I'm actually going to send this one back. Um, this has the same thing. The straps tuck away, but the way that the straps tuck away is you roll that down and then you zip the straps up, you know, so they go in like that zip them up and then it comes with a briefcase carrier so you can carry it briefcase style you zip those up so you kind of get the idea here and this is the briefcase strap I'm guessing so yeah this one I really like the idea of it I really wanted it to work but this whole side loading thing I feel like it's just not realistic for what you and I as truckers might be going for because we need something that might keep a little bit more organized and so yeah that's kind of my thoughts on this one but I'm just because it doesn't work for me doesn't mean it won't work for you this might be exactly what you're looking for so that's the other bag and then the bag that I'm going to keep is this one. So this is the Amazon 
Amazon Basics Slim Weekender Bag. So this one's cool. This one, you guys are going to be like, yeah, obviously that's the winner, as did I. But let's start at the back. So this one, same style. I can disconnect the clips down here and put them in the back, and the straps disappear. So I could do that. This one has pads on the back, and then it also has a pocket down here. So I could put my passport, um, you know, as far as traveling goes, I could put more sensitive things for pickpocketers so they won't be able to get me. So that's cool for that reason, but for trucking, um, I don't really know what I could use that for. Maybe, I don't know, a flask of whiskey or something. I'm a vodka drinker, but maybe a flask of vodka. I don't know. Got to get away from that DOT, though. <laughs> so, yeah, the and then this also slides in between, like on a suitcase. You can slide that on a suitcase handle. So that's not really anything that has to do with trucking, but for travel, that's really cool. And the other, the Heinz Eagle bag does not have padding, the pocket, or anything. It's just a flat back. So... That's what's really cool about that side. And I'm going to reposition myself. I broke my back a few years ago. And I can't sit, like, unsupported for very long. But anyway, so this is the, this is the Amazon Basics. So let's, this has so much storage, you guys. I don't even know where to start. Let's start right with the cup holder. So the cup holder, same style. It unzips. I don't know how much you'll be able to get into there. Uh, it's, it's not very big, but we're not traveling out of our backpacks. Like, we have cup holders in our truck, so realistically, like, would this be a deal breaker? No, it wouldn't. For me, for trucking, it wouldn't. So there's that. And then this first pocket here is just an empty... I don't know if you can see... Oh yeah, empty pocket. And the cool thing I like about this is it's orange inside, so it's really easy to see what's in there. The, the Heinz Eagle is just black, so kind of hard to see into those deep pockets. And then, so that's the first pocket. And then this pocket is pretty cool. It's got storage for days. So you could put, like, Q-tips, toothbrush, toothpaste, you know, I mean, the, it's, we could go for days on what you could put in here for a driver. <laughs> so it has a ton of potential for storage. And then this pocket right here is another pocket. And, you know, just plain pocket. You could put another flask of vodka in there if you wanted. Um, hope the DOT doesn't see that. Just kidding. Just kidding! Jeez, calm down. Um, so that's that pocket, and then this pocket right here is a really cool deep pocket, and it's actually an access, po access area to get into the main compartment, so I'll show you that. So you open up this one, like this, and it opens huh, like that, and then... I hope you guys can see this. Maybe I should scoot back a little. I don't know. So this one is like that. So you can still fit a lot of stuff in here. It's just not suitcase style with the straps. Or maybe it does. I haven't really... Maybe these turn into... I haven't really played around with it too much. But no, I don't think it does. So that's just one compartment. Then you can unzip this and make it bigger if you want. So this top pocket that I was showing you goes right here. So you could put your laptop in here if you wanted. You could put an iPad, whatever you want. And then um, you could put, you could separate your clothes if you wanted, like, you know, more warmer clothes to summery clothes because since we're traveling through a lot of states, the weather changes a lot. Or you could do shoes and clothes. I mean, whatever, whatever you wanted. And you could separate them by using this if you wanted to. Or you cannot. You can just kind of leave it open and then shut it like that, you know, however you want to do it. But 
Um, yeah, so this is the bag that I'm going to keep, and I'm going to be able to fit, like, my workout clothes, my cycling clothes, my winter clothes, like, everything. I'm just going to grab some packing cubes, and I'll be able to load this thing up. Even without packing cubes, I'll be able to load this thing up with everything I need, and I think it's going to be really great. So this is the one that I found that I'm going to stick with, and... I think they come in different sizes. This is the, so this is the slim one. They have an Amazon Basics carry-on bag that's, I believe it's a little bit bigger, but since this is the slim model, it's, I don't think it's as big. So, I don't know, but I haven't seen that one in person, so I can't really give you a fair opinion on what I think about that. But, yeah, so this, zip it up. Boom. So I'll be able to have my backpack that I've been using completely gone. So I'll be able to have my, my stuff that I had in my Under Armour bag and in my backpack condensed into this one bag and I can just throw it over my shoulder and go and leave, which I think is going to be so nice because then all I have to do is grab my food bag and I don't have five things in my hands. And I think it's I think it's gonna work out really good. So check it out. This is the Amazon Basics Heinz Eagle Witzman. Those are the order of those bags. So yeah, and there's t um, also I think these are only like sixty dollars. They're really affordable. So I would check them out. Check out the links. I'll link some, and then I'll link a couple other ones that I found that were really recommended, but I didn't end up buying those because I, I really felt like one of these were going to work and they were cheaper. So there are some more expensive ones out there that do the exact same thing, but honestly I feel like this is going to be really good. So yeah, if this video is helpful, let me know. If you buy one of these, let me know how you like it because I'm really curious to see how this could be beneficial to other drivers too and um, don't forget to subscribe follow me at the Lacenator on Instagram and I will see you guys out there have a good day bye